So this is where we're at. I made the arms. These bits here out of those bits of scrap that I have. They're just bolted in two places. <coughs> I can if I wanted to, but I'll have to see to later. Is cut cut some out here, and then they could come over. Obviously, this would have to go. This little bit of ridge here. But yeah, now on to the hard bit, which is I've got to make a frame out of some of this stuff I've got, which is about 85 mil construction steel. So <coughs> those two bits, one of which I'm going to cut now, are going to go all the way from the side, all the way across, and then I'm going to have two bits, that bit and that bit for the legs coming up obviously either end so yeah I'm going to use some more of these to make brackets which the uprights will uh, fit into there'll be a bracket either side an L, big L bracket <coughs> the trouble is this metal is so heavy that if I welded it together, the frame, I wouldn't be able to move it. But it's all going to be able to bolt together. This this comes apart, obviously, as you can see. And basically, so that can be moved and set up quite easily. So, uh, yeah, but so we've got the bearing here and the bearing there. And then there's going to be one bearing in the middle of the frame here and then likewise in the middle on the top frame and it's all going to slot together and be really cushy hopefully <laughs> we shall see so yeah i've got to chop some metal and then drill a load of holes i've got quite a few of these plates left still so i'm going to use them uh, they're about six mil five mil but yeah I've got about another fifty of them. So yes lots of drilling and plasma cutting and uh, using this thing I've got a couple of new blades. So that won't muck about. Let's see if it's on.
that. So yeah, <coughs> I'll just finish doing this and then I'll start making the plates to bolt the whole thing together.